Hey y'all, what it is and what it ain't, okay? It's beauty in the struggle, nigga. Beauty, beauty. Beauty. Yeah. It's beauty in the struggle, ugliness in the success. Now, today, like I told y'all in the vlogs, I am giving y'all a QA. And this is like, you know, questions about me. Like I posted on my Instagram and I told people, hey, you know, ask me questions for my YouTube channel or whatever. And I got a lot of questions, although it was from two people, but you know, supporters are supporters and we love them, okay? But anyways, now, while I'm doing this Q&A with y'all, I'm definitely going to be um, making me a snack because I'm going to the gym after this video. And I'm going to be making me a rice cake with peanut butter and honey, okay? If you don't know, get into it because it's so damn good, oh my god. And aside from that, y'all, the jacket is definitely from my brand. It's the jacket. I, I made this hoodie like, who knows, a while ago. And I sold out now, but it says different breed. Respect me with a little heart on the side. And in the back, has my logo. Y'all can see it right? Right. Super fine. This col these colorways were like red, um, red, black, and yellow. The other one's mad hard. I ain't even going with you. But I don't even have the yellow one. I just have this one and the green one. But I know somebody that has the yellow one. Hopefully. We need to get into that. Anyways. So I'm going to get into these questions with y'all to get right into the video. Because like I said, I got to go to the gym. Okay. Now, I'm pretty sure I can go to my archives. Because I posted this like a couple days ago. Um, Let me see. Okay, yeah. So, I'm gonna get into these videos, but let me get a plate. Okay. So, the first... Okay, the first question was... Hello? That's my grandma. The first question was, what are some of your bad habits that you want to work on? Damn. <sighs> bad habits that I want to work on. Bad habits that I want to work on. Bad habits I want to work on. Uh, that's definitely something to think about. What bad habits do I have? Okay, well, I one would probably be that when I have like when I find like some free time. Maybe like a couple minutes or an hour, maybe of free time that I'm not really on nothing. I would like be on TikTok, you know. I I, th I don't know if that's a bad habit, but you know, I could be doing something else, you know, reading a book or something. Or another bad habit that I have is see when she when like when that question is asked, the first thing I think about is like personally, like. What do I do personally that's like a bad thing that I always do? And I want to say, okay, I, yeah, I'm going to answer how I want to answer it. Like, a bad habit that I want to say that I have is probably like, um, trusting people maybe. I want to say like, or probably like always thinking the worst. Well, I don't think the worst. As far as like my life and its goals, I don't think the worst. But like, I mean thinking the worst as in other people. Like, always thinking other people got other intentions, like... People be BSing, like, they, you know, it's just, I just don't be trusting people. So, I would say that's a bad habit. Because, you know, you can't be like that with everybody now. <sighs> but, who knows. Um, another bad habit. I don't really have many bad habits. I ain't even gonna hold you, like, I'm not even trying to say that to be cocky. It's just, I don't know, like, right, there, right now, I'm kind of... And good habits, really, y'all. Go to the gym. You feel me? I make content for y'all. Like, I'm working a lot. Like, I'm focused on what I want. So. Okay, the next question. The next question was, um, what's my style? Like, who put that shit on type? And the person who put that on was definitely Tiana Taylor. Hands down. Like, who, who, like, who would not agree? Who would not agree? Like, come on, be for real. Be for real. She could she could pull off the tightest clothes, the showing body clothes and all that stuff like that to the like biggest clothes in the whole wide world. Like, 
come on that's what that's fire like that's definitely my style like the whole the whole loose pants big shirt type of vibe going on like that's fire with some fire sneakers come on like what who don't what what if it's girls out there that dress like that that's that's y'all style we should be cool because at the end of the day it's giving that weird them type of tomboy girls but we still have our little girly side like don't want to get our nails done and get our lashes done toes you feel me still want us to wear like our two pieces from time to time but you feel me for the most part we want to be comfortable and that is definitely the go-to for shit sure like for shit sure sure okay the next question was why are you starting to get more into youtube okay as y'all can tell like i started youtube um oh this is my pre-workout time okay as y'all can tell i started to get into youtube like a year or two ago right and i i ain't gonna lie, I always like the idea of youtube like getting out there recording in front of a like recording yourself talking to a camera all damn day like feel me vlogging showing your lifestyle like I like that, and I like, you know, having other people in my videos, conversating, like, I like that, you feel me? It's, I feel like YouTube is like a outlet, maybe, or it's like a, as I'm using it for, like, a documentary of a person's life, like, a person, you can see a person on YouTube go from zero to, like, everything, like, you feel me? And I, I like that, I like to see people's journeys and stuff like that, and I want to join the way with people seeing my journey, because I ain't gonna lie, y'all, I got a lot of stuff that I want to accomplish in life, so, if y'all watching me right now... Y'all gonna be, like, looking in, like, a year or shit, two, and be like, damn, like, she really did that. And I did. For sure. But right now, y'all, I ain't gonna lie, the YouTube goal is to reach 100 subscribers, okay? 100 subscribers, y'all. Let's get to it, okay? But aside from that, um, the reason I started back on YouTube was the simple fact that I want to grow my brand, right? And I feel like... You know, I watch a lot of podcasts and a lot of interviews and, you know, people putting their inputs on their clothing brand, how they grow it, and woo 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 And everybody's saying, like, people love to see the journey. People love authenticity. People love things that they can relate to and stuff like that. So, since I love recording myself and I will be 100% transparent all the time, and the fact that I know that my customers and, you know, people like y'all, y'all would like to see a whole journey, see the process, like, why not record? Like, why not show it? Like, you feel me? And then... I like to help people. So I feel like when me recording my journey and me showing my ups and downs and what I'm going through and what I have to go through my daily day to get to where I want to go in my life, I feel like it'll motivate some people to do the same thing if this is the route they want to take. You know what I'm saying? Because I know, I know for sure that this route, as far as like um, entrepreneurship goes, not everybody wants to do that. Like some people rather work for somebody else and they'll be completely happy with that. And that's fine. You feel me? There's nothing wrong with that. Like I feel like happiness and peace is the most important thing. Like wherever you find that happiness and peace at, you do that. You do that. You feel me? But as far as me, working with somebody else, it's a no-go. I'm sorry. I can't do it. The next question is, if you could hang with one celebrity for a day, who would you pick and why? Mm. One celebrity for a day. She probably not a celebrity. But I feel like she is a big impactor. I want to say uh, Megan Ashley. For sure. If you don't know who Megan Ashley is, then you would know her through B. Simone. B. Simone cool too now. I feel like if I get Megan Ashley, I'll get B. Simone as a whole duo. But Megan Ashley for sure. Like, as you can see on the podcast and the type of person she is and how, the way she talk, how much experience she got as far as this thing called life, her relationship with God. You feel me? Like, she's so in tune. Like, and I feel like every conversation with her would be so impactful. Like, I would be tuned in. Like, I would want to go be with her and walk around with a fucking notebook. Like, and then on top of that, her personality is super fun. She's super funny. Like, she more on the chill side. But, you feel me? She, she real wise, in my opinion. Not saying wise isn't old, but like, she, you feel me? The next question would be, you plan on doing traveling vlogs? For sure. For sure, I'll do traveling vlogs, for sure. Like, I'm going to be traveling back and forth to Miami. Not saying all the time, but you know, that's where my mom at, and um, that's where my people's at. So, I go back there, you know, from time to time, and I'll vlog it, for sure. But as far as, like, out of the country, different other states vlogging, for sure. Once I get the bread and I'm up there, you know, we're going to be doing that for sure. Like, you could definitely look forward to that. 
Next question was, describe your worst intimate experience. That took a turn. Um, worst intimate experience. Should I tell y'all that? Like, <laughs> I feel like worst intimate experience. I know it's one that's right here on my right here, like the first one that comes in my head. But I don't like talking about people, y'all. But I mean, it's not like y'all know who I'm talking about. It's only me and him that know. Well, yeah. Um. Me and this guy, we, um, you know, we, boom, 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 boom. Um, it was so bad, like, he lasted, like, I kid you not, like, like, three pumps, probably. And it was very upsetting. It was very, very, very upsetting, like, I will go more into detail about that, but that's 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 a story for another day. Who's that? You. Who? You. Next question is behind the scenes with you working on. Okay, that's not even a question, but I get that. Um, advice on creating your own brand. I will. I will answer that question in this video. But, if y'all want me to answer the question, comment down below. I'll make a separate video for that because I feel like that should have its own video by right, itself. So. But, what I can say, starting your own brand is start. Oh, yeah. Start, like, with my brand, I didn't do too much research on it. I just knew I wanted a clothing brand. And I just went out there and did it. Like design, found a person to um um do the screen print jackets for me. This was the first design. No, it wasn't this design, but it was a jacket similar to this one, y'all. It was it's like a real similar to this one, but a different logo on the back. The first, the first hoodie I ever made. I just did it. Like I don't know about um clothing. Just went out there and said, "Yolo, I want this." I started. And now on this journey, I have learned a lot as far as clothing and life. That plays a toll on why I'm here today. But I would make um, its own video for advice on creating your own clothing brand. Because that one I feel like I'm going to have to prepare more for. Like, give some pointers that I'll have to tell y'all. But for one, it's definitely um, start. And do a bit of research. You know, don't go in there blind. But, you know, hey. Um, story times. I think she just giving me advice on what video to make. But I will give y'all story time if y'all want. Um, some gym routine recommendations. Sound like Q&A. If y'all want gym routine recommendations, let me know. Like, if y'all want a whole gym vlog, I'll take y'all through, like, my leg day workouts and my upper body workouts. That'll be, like, a whole week of workouts. I'll do that vlog for y'all for sure if y'all want that. Um, what type of content will we see on your channel? That's what I'm Okay. The type of content that I plan on showing y'all is basically what I'm doing now. Like, Q&As, um, advisory um, videos, um, story times if y'all want. Um, like I said, this is a, here's a whole documentary. So I'm going to be giving you vlogs on what I do on my daily basis, my ups and downs, like, um, my wins, my loses, and everything like that. Like, this channel is going to be real transparent. Like, this, I wouldn't say this is more of a channel of the whole find your matches and you know link it with other people you know them type of videos this is just more like a video about this i think not video but this this channel will be more about my life and my journey to you know reaching my highest goals that i've set for myself you know what i'm saying so that's just that's like, like i said this is a documentary this is a documentary channel i'm not even gonna hold you a whole documentary channel like learn about me who i am what i want out of life all that i will tell my goals but 
it's not even the best idea. Y'all just know that. For one, y'all just know that the first step right now in my life is definitely get my clothing brand where I want it to be, you know. Somebody asked me, what are your hobbies? My hobbies, I say, would be, um, mm, I heard. A hobby of mine what I, that I say would be at the gym. I like going to the gym. I ain't gonna ask a hobby. Um, I would say I enjoy cooking, although I haven't been cooking lately, but I enjoy cooking when I know I have time to cook. Um, designing. I like designing. I've got more into it since I moved down here to um, Georgia. So I like, I like designing. That's fun. Um, another hobby will have to be, I ain't gonna lie, y'all, I really do enjoy being around people. Like, people I love, friends, like, I like quality time. I like having conversations and stuff like that, getting to know people, picking people's brain, you feel me? Like, I like knowing people's stories, like, you feel me? So I like stuff like that. I think that's a hobby as well. Um, I ain't gonna lie, new hobby is dead ass YouTube, for real. Like, this whole platform is definitely a hobby to me now. Hobby I definitely love, I definitely love and enjoy because, like I said, I like talking to y'all. And like I told y'all in the vlogs, it's easy for me to make an hour-long vlog because I talk. <laughs> like, I can literally talk to a camera all day long. Like, I don't know why, it's just in me, it ain't on me, you know? What made you want to start your YouTube channel? I told y'all that already. What goals do you have for yourself? Let's say the first goal, as far as YouTube, would be to reach 100 subscribers. Um, I don't know much about that watch time stuff yet, but let's just say enough watch time for me to become monetized, you know? So let's just say that monetization on YouTube and as well as reaching 100 subscribers and, you know, the subscribers will go up from there, but that's a goal for YouTube. Um, personal goal would be clear skin, um, tone body, you know, smaller ways, um, I do joke a lot about me wanting a dumpy, which is a big butt. But I ain't gonna lie, I don't really want like a huge butt. Like the dumpy is probably like out of control when I say it, but I just want like um I want a butt that fits my body, you know, a nice, you know, nice little, you know what I'm saying? That fit my body. Like I got boobs, I want my butt to match my boobs, you know. I don't want my boobs to overpower my body. I want a nice proportion from the side where my boobs are like and my butt is like, you know what I'm saying? I don't want a huge ass to where I'm walking around and everybody's staring at my ass. Like, I don't like that. I don't I don't like huge ass, asses that cause attention. You know what I'm saying? That's not, I don't want that type of attention. You know what I'm saying? That's not, that's just, that's just not me. Um, and as far as life goals, like I said, I do want my brand to blow. So, let's just say right now, the short-term goals would be to probably reach at least 1,500 followers on Instagram um, and be getting at least 20 sales on um on like a daily basis or a weekly basis you know what I'm saying 20 orders that I'm shipping out per week or per day if God bless me that way you know what I'm saying um I would tell you my other goals but like I said you're not really supposed to be explaining your goals like that because not everybody would understand it but Maybe one day I'll tell y'all everything I want for myself in life. Because it is a lot. like, and But the first thing is definitely, you know, for YouTube to be monetized. And for my clothing brand to, um, you know, reach the goals I just told y'all about. Um, oh, and um, another goal for myself. Y'all probably don't think it's important, but I love love, y'all. And hopefully, you know, one day I find me a man who loves me as much as I love him. And we could be out here making money together, okay? Like, I want a relationship that we build empires. Like, I want to have bread. I want to be like, one more, like, me and my man to have stuff set up for our family. My camera's saying that she overheating. What we call her, y'all? Sonya? Sonya overheating, y'all. So, let me, let me get through this. Um, somebody asked me what made me move. I moved to Georgia because I need to get away from the distractions. I need to get away from people. Everybody places things like being in Miami, every street corner, every drive down the road is always like a memory of like a bad way I was feeling. Like it just it was just too many memories and it wasn't good ones. Like the bad memories overpowered the good memories that and I hated it so much. I couldn't do it. I felt like the air there was just like so toxic for me. Like 
I feel like once I moved here, I can breathe. Like, I feel like once I moved here, I'm way more productive. You feel me? I'm investing more of my time into what I want. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I feel like this move was definitely for me, for sure. To better myself, to um, elevate my career, elevate my life for real, elevate personally. Like, <sighs> the next question is, how do you like the move? I gotta told you I love the move. Like, I'm more productive, I can breathe here, like, I feel like it's nothing but opportunity for me here, like, it's nothing but ways for me to make good memories, more of good memories and bad memories, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not saying that when I get here, everything's gonna be pitch perfect, like, that's not how life is, but the goal is for, you know, things to be more on the positive side than on the negative side, you know? Somebody asked me, what made you stop YouTube in the first place? Inconsistency, undisciplined, <laughs> everything around me, really, like. Like I, got, like, I don't know if I told y'all this probably in a vlog, but I would, like, always get into these modes of, like, probably depression and, like, super sad, feeling bad for myself, and just not having the energy nor the strength to get up and, like, put time into myself and what I want, like, so that's why I was never really consistent with it, but I was, life was hitting hard when I first started, like, I wasn't even in the best place mentally, emotionally, like, self-worth was out the door, like, it was, it was real bad when I first started, but all that was behind the scenes, you know? It was, it was, it was, it was just, mm, it just, oof, yeah. But, you know, I'm in a better headspace now, emotional-wise, um, mentally-wise. So, you know, that's why I feel like this is probably the best time for me to, you know, get the ball rolling and be consistent and, you know, go after what I want. Um, Somebody said, how old are you? Uh, yeah, this is the last question, actually. Somebody said, how old am I? And then, um, I am 21. 21, y'all. Y'all know the goal is that before I reach my 22nd birthday, I'm going to have my own crib. So let's manifest that. Before I hit 22, I'm going to be in my own place. Okay? And my birthday is in April, y'all. So that is, what month we in? July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, April. That's eight. That's nine months. It's possible? I think it's possible. Somebody else did ask me how you do that. That damn asshole. He's, he's such a butthole, bro. He's probably gonna talk about some old. Oh, how you do that? I'm gonna be like, do what? Oh, make your breath smell like, like, bro. He's so irritating, but I don't even know why I just read that. It's just like, <laughs> that, damn, that damn guy. But, um, y'all, that's the end of this video. I'm about to go to the gym, okay? Thank y'all for watching. Mm -hmm. Thank y'all for watching. Okay. Um, make sure I like, comment, and subscribe on this video. If you didn't like it, don't be scared to dislike. Like, it's okay. Like, all interactions on my videos are welcome, okay? If y'all want to be mean to me, because I heard, I watch a lot of videos, and they be saying, that, like, once you get known out there, people be real mean to you, saying all type of bad stuff. Um, listen, <laughs> be nice. You know, this is, this is a positive environment you guys okay but yeah so like i said make sure you like comment and subscribe on this video you know what i'm saying um stay in tune for more posts um i am trying to post twice a week i just spit sorry i am trying to post twice a week oh my gosh whatever i don't even know where the video just stopped at but like i was saying before y'all you know got interrupted make sure y'all like comment subscribe on this video if you have negative comments, keep them to yourself. Don't be mean to me, okay? Because I don't got time for that, okay? Um, you can like the video. You can dislike the video. Whatever you want. You know, all interactions are very much welcome, okay? And y'all stay tuned for more videos. I'm going to try to post, like, twice a week. So, it's, like, going to be the weekly vlogs. And then it's also going to be, like, something like this in between. You know what I'm saying? Like, a Q&A or, like, informational video. You know, stuff like that. And, yeah, thank y'all for watching me. Like, I enjoy y'all, you know, my 40 some subscribers. And, it's, listen, y'all, it's road to 100 subscribers, okay? 100, okay? Because once we reach that, it's only up from there, okay? Thank y'all. Later. Peace.